Hello viewers, welcome to Learner Key. In this video, we'll discuss about what are the free courses that are provided by Great Learning. So Great Learning is a platform which is providing almost 1000 plus free courses to all the graduate and postgraduate students on trending technologies like data science, cyber security, digital marketing, machine learning, artificial intelligence, etc. Right. So now let's get started how to register for a free course and how to complete the course. So now this is the portal that is appearing on the screen. So this is how the landing page of uh, great learning will be. So now if you observe on the top right, you have login and sign up. So once if you are new to this particular great learning platform, you just sign up or else you can directly click on login. And you can use your Google credentials in order to log in to this great learning portal. So now just I am clicking on continue with Google. Just select your Gmail through which you want to access the portal. And see this is how your portal look like after you log in into the portal. So if you observe here, you have explore free online courses, just click on that. And here you can observe almost many courses which are completely of free of cost. See, all these are free of cost and there are various domains related, uh, uh, various domains here so that is IT and software where you'll have programming languages like Java, Python. Python fundamentals, data structures in Java, front-end and back-end developers, blockchain basics, data structures in C language, so on, so on. If you want to check more, you can uh, just click on see all courses. And now if you want more, so there are some other uh, domains like data science. So if you are interested in data science, just click on that. And in this you have various courses like data science foundations, basics of exploratory data analysis. So if you observe all these are free courses that comes under data science platform. And similarly you have for artificial intelligence, all these are the courses. And you have some of the courses in cyber security. If you are really interested in cyber security, ethical hacking, network security, you can just uh, choose this platform and complete all the courses which are present under this pool. And if you are interested in cloud computing, just click on cloud computing. And here you can observe all these are the various courses that comes under uh, cloud pool. So here we have all the courses which are from beginner to advanced. So cloud foundations is a beginner course and cloud foundation advanced something advanced course. If you if you want, you can observe the rating given for each and every course that is present here. So all these are the courses which are completely free of cost. You just explore by clicking on see all courses. All right. So like this, you have many courses and you can select any of one course and complete the course. So now I'm just, um, I just want to um, tell you how to complete one course. Suppose consider, I just want to complete a course called data visualization using Tableau. So this is the course which I have already completed. I'll just show you how this course can be done. All right. So now, so this is how your certificate will be after completion of the course. And here, if you observe here, it is completely free, free of cost. And you can complete the course in two hours and it is purely self-based course, right? So now it is a free lifetime access. That is once you enroll into the course, it, this particular content can be accessed throughout the, throughout the lifetime. So all these are the concepts which will be covered under this course. Like what is the introduction and ad agenda? That is what is the purpose of uh, visualization and all and uh, how to install uh, install Tableau, all that we'll be discussing. And what is business intelligence? So here they'll be discussing about what is the importance of business intelligence and and why business intelligence is required. So for uh, generating reports or else for making decision making, we usually require uh, some business intelligence tools. So that 
uh, Tableau is one business intelligence tool which is used for data visualization. So this is how what is the this in this we'll discuss about what is the need and what is the um, definition of data visualization. And here we'll be discussing some of the data visualization tools. But maybe in this course we'll be completely concentrating on Tableau uh, visualization tool. All right. So we'll discuss what is Tableau and there are many other self-paced videos just you complete all this and you have demos also now you can learn how uh, how you load a data set into tableau and how you can visualize that all that can be done right so once you complete so what you'll have is you'll get a certificate which will be like this and the certificate can be uh, uploaded into your uh, linkedin or facebook or else you can just add it to your resume so what I usually suggest for all the students is so there might be many courses which are present uh, in this particular platform but I always suggest the students just to select any one of the platform that is if you are completely interested in data science just try to complete all the courses which are present in your data science pool if you are in if you want to be a uh, artificial intelligent engineer or else um, uh, a role which you want to play in artificial intelligence then you can complete all the courses which comes under this pool so you first i suggest you have many courses available here and if you are interested in big data go for a big data pool if you are interested in digital marketing just go for a digital marketing pool right so all these are the different courses that are uh, provided by your great learning platform and i just want you to show one more uh, which is available in this great learning so yeah see here so here this is a pool i mean like so here if you observe it's a select a career path and power ahead right so here if you observe there are various career paths here so if you want to be uh, something related to data science so let's check here so if you want to be a data scientist and if you want to perform all the courses if you want to learn all the courses which comes under data science you just select this data science and see if you want to be a data analyst just click on this and when you click on this you will have all the courses which are mandatory uh, uh, to have some knowledge to be a data analyst right so if you want to be a data analyst just click on data analyst and here click on explore courses and if you observe there are some again a curation of courses like data science foundation python fundamentals for beginners python for data analysis and probability for data science statistics for data science statistical analysis data visualization uh, data visualization using Tableau you will be learning data visualization with Power BI with Python you will be learning and you will also discuss what do you what do you mean by exploratory data analysis that will learn with the help of Python and for a data analyst MySQL databases that is uh, querying is very very important so all that MySQL basics you will be learning so how SQL can be used for in data science that you'll be learning and how do you write SQL triggers and all you'll be learning and if you want to perform any analytics using SQL and Python so that you'll be learning like this you have almost 15 courses 15 courses that should be learned by a data analyst uh, to excel right so if you want to be a data analyst you should have a minimum knowledge of all these courses which are available so this is the case with data analyst so once you have completed you'll be you'll be getting a certificate so this is something just which is given for uh, data science uh, foundations or uh, python fundamentals but whatever be the case you just need to complete all the skills which are present here so after completing maybe you'll be uh, you'll be having a gist of what a data analyst should have right so this is like this in great learning platform you can select set of skills that you want to learn based on the role you want to play in the organization right so this is the case with data analyst 
so now suppose if you want to be a some other role like um, let's let's get into a cloud computing platform so again in cloud computing platform you can be a cloud engineer you can be a cloud devops engineer you can be a cloud architect like this you have many career paths right so you have many career paths which comes under cloud platform so if you want in management if you want to be a market research analyst you can select just click on that you'll be getting all the skills which should be learned by a market research analyst suppose if you want to be a digital marketing engineer and in that you'll be having digital marketer content writer see here you have an arrow mark just click on that Co content writer copywriter seo anal seo analyst digital marketing executive seo executive so on and so on like this you will be having n number of roles that can come under digital marketing um, skill right so like this if if you want to be a if you want to play a role in cyber security so what roles you usually have so first just know what roles you can play as a cyber security um, person right so cyber security analyst is one role so if you observe here you have a minimum package that a person can earn as a cyber security analyst so like that if you want to be a ethical hacker so the average salary is 5 lakhs plus so security architect so if you want to be a chief information security officer the average salary for uh, cisos 22.2 lakhs on an average so if you want to be a security architect so it will be 29.0 l average salary so like this you will be having n number of roles related to different different domains so i request students to select only one role and get all the skills which comes under uh, a so and so career path right so if you want to be the most popular careers that we have is data scientist ai engineer digital marketer engine digital marketer software developer so these are the four most popularly used but if you want to be a good digital marketing engineer or a this digital marketing person you can just click on that exp click on explore courses study all the courses which are provided by this great learning platform and just acquire the knowledge and finally add all this credentials to your linkedin or else resume so when you usually upload your resume either in linkedin maybe it might be linkedin or else it might be in uh, any uh, uh, job searching portals like uh, monster indeed right so usually how a uh, interior will check is they will filter they will filter the resumes based on the skills right so one important thing is when you are uploading a resume to any job portal important thing is just acquire the skill better get some certification on that particular skill add that to your, to your resume and then upload it so whenever they search that is whenever the company people searches for a person with so and so skills obviously your resume will be shortlisted right so that is very very important so first fix your domain that is fix your interest learn all the skills related to that interest try to do a certification in that add that certification into your resume or else in in your linkedin profile so this is how you can use all the free courses that are available in your great learning platform so this is very much useful so if you want to have more information regarding this internships free certifications and anything related to data science please refer to the learner key channel thank you